Is it Captain Blanche, the camera on? No, Nisha. Well, I think that I saw the red lot, eh? <laughs> lot? <laughs> red dot, eh? I'm just kidding here, eh? Hey, look at this. Hey, but viewers, hey. hey. It was all calm to a half an hour ago. time I'm doing the maiden flight here a eh? it was calm all day and when we came to the runway because we have time now eh? again the wind was boring somewhere here eh? but this is unbelievable hey eh? this is really getting depressing with this wind day eh? this year eh? <laughs> and if we don't have time to fly then it is calm eh, as I don't know what eh? as a stiff man yeah but every time I come here to try to film something, eh? When, when I do the maintenance, there is always uh, not windy. Maybe you should start to do the maiden flights, Captain Blush, because hey, you have the calm weather. And I'm always struggling here the in maiden this maiden flight. Eh? I can do it, eh? Right now. <laughs> of course, first of all, salute all subscribers and viewers. Thanks for your support, for visiting our channel, for all your comments, for your subscriptions, and of course, for, oh. for being our friends. And spreading and your legs, uh, <laughs> spreading the good spreading passion. Spreading and sharing the passion for the RC planes from this channel to the rest of the world because we already know by now that this is the best hobby that you can find in your life. Eh? And I will start quickly because hey, I'm so lucky that the, even the rain will start to fall eh, pretty quickly here if I will babble too much. Now what do we have today? The famous question. The beautiful and sexy, I will show it. Iconic Brewster Buffalo, the first, now I was saying on the unboxing video, that this was the first low wing plane, not the first I have, corre I have corrected you. Of course, Captain Blush, the cousin. Captain Blush has corrected me, this was in fact the first monosexual plane. Middle plane. Well, with the middle wings, but that means that it was just one wing plane and it was actually the first one that uh, Navy was using during the Second World War. Like this, good enough, enough of the history yes, viewers. enough, enough. Because hey, hey, history is way back. And now Jurafly, I must salute Jurafly because they have decided to make this one in the foam version and in such a good way that you don't even have to screw with the landing wheel. And you can have the feeling of flying this sexy, sexy, iconic Warbird all over again. Eh? Now a few words about assembly. Of course, eh, the assembly went together perfectly. Eh? Yes, 20 it. minutes. <laughs> Or in even half less. an hour, viewers, the plane was ready to made in flight. You just glue here. What did I have to glue? The back here and these coverages for the, for servos. the servos. This dummy exhausts. I mean, it looks pretty good with this exhaust. And that's it. Of course, you do have here for the landing, the, the plastic uh, was this protection. But I did cover it even though with the tape because I don't want to screw with this sexy, beautiful foam. And I have forgotten to. Yeah, you, you will not do it now. Cut this. I won't not cut it now. Not always on the video. No, 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 no. no. But uh, I know that enough of air will come from these coolings here. Now about the CG, I have went now with this. Of course, you get already on the on the cell page. You get the instruction manual now. The travels. There are just one travels all around the plane. Uh, no double rates here. The I, battery I, is I graphene. Use, and I will use, wait, I will come to that. I will use 35% uh, Expo on this one. And we were wondering about this angle of the motor and whatnot. Eh? And this is because, so when you put the full throttle, the plane will not just climb up. Yes. We were wondering if this is supposed to be like this, such an angle, but I got comments that this must be if the plane want to keep flying the straight line. Now, of course, the recommended battery is 2200. They don't say how much C rating of that battery. I was using the simple, I don't know, uh, 25 or 35 C ZP compact battery. And that battery was actually, I have put it all the way to the motor and the plane was still tail heavy. I couldn't get the recommended CG. So today I will be using, I will open this. You can show to the viewers. The graphene. 2200 free cell 65C battery. Now this battery is heavier than the simple ZP compact plane uh, battery and this will give me the recommended CG. And I hey, put it, it... Why is there color on the receiver? Because I have reused this receiver from the drain pipe jetty. Oh, <laughs> yes. 
So this is it? Yes. And for this plan you will only need four channels and that's it, viewers say. Holy holy moly, how do you say? I have set it to four minutes and we will see how much I will suck after four minutes, presuming that this will be some good maiden flight. Now, of course, I was thinking on the landing, uh, because we will land on the belly with this one and huh. again, viewers, we will have the hey, head tossing. Was this sound, was this sound okay? Yeah, this sound was okay because I have set the brake on the motor. Ah, the yes, yes, yes. Because I How did know. you do it? Usually, do you have I, a... I will explain to the viewers. Usually, if you try to land and the prop goes like this, hey, I have broken many props with this. So I have set the brake and the engine. I will show you. Look at this. The engine brakes. Yes. And you can set this like the calibration of the ESC, but you must wait. You don't just wait for two beeps, but you have to wait. You will get two beeps. Didi, 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 I think three times. And after that, it will start to, to make a sound. You will hear the music. And after that music, you just put the throttle down, unplug it, plug it again, and you will have the brake on the motor. And that's it, hey. Oh, Captain Blush, what? Yes. I will just now, I do have, look at this, a little mixing. I will mix with my hand, but just in case I have elevator to, I mean, ailerons to rudder and... and I it. have set the triple rates for me, but I will use the recommended one, say. So, what the hell? This is it, Captain Blush. Hmm? Yes. I have checked, I think that this plane has enough power, and I, I have also put it here a little for a better grip. This uh, rubber, 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 what do you... It's not that you can buy in Hobby King, yes. Rubber thing, I will call it this, self -adhesive. Rubber pad, rubber pad. Rubber self-adhesive rubber pad for that you put under the batteries, but it also comes good in hand for a better grip. And you can buy this in such, in such pieces on the Hobby King, and it's very cheap, but very good, eh? So this is it. Yes, this is it, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Hey, the power is sick, hey. Now, of course, we have the side wind again or something. I don't know what, hey. Again, I will have to take off in the... In the... Hey, I can almost see the pilots inside. Again, I will have to take off in the sun, hey. Are you ready? No, you don't have to. Why? It's a hand toss. It, it can pull. The engine is very strong. And the engine you can go strong. there into the... Our... Our... Um, Ho our town. Throw it there because we have the side wind. That's really good enough. Yes. Are you ready, Captain Blush, for something, eh? Yes. I didn't hear you wish me good luck. Yeah, good luck and be ready for your fingers to go on the elevator. I will, eh? Do we have a little up? So this is. Will it. you what? Three quarters of the throttle? I will just. I don't know what, eh? It's always hard to decide for the first time because you don't know what the plane will do. Oh, it, you will have to go there. Yes, yes, you will have to go. Yes. Directly in the sun, eh? I hate this, eh? Are you ready? Yes. Oh. <laughs> no problem. Oh, yeah! No, of course, I just wonder... What? I won't trim it much today because no, I got no. in this strong wind, eh? But hey, pretty good, eh? Look at this little devil, do you see? And this is the first buffalo in the Slovenia, you know? Look, <laughs> the wind is tossing it, eh? But hey, it does look pretty good, eh? I will try to fly lower. Oh, the wind is getting stronger by the second. Power. <laughs> and the power is really great, eh? Yes. Now, viewers, excuse me because I won't screw too much here in this wind because I don't want to crash this plane today. We will try some stunts the next time when we will have a calm day. Pretty fast. Yes. Okay, how will you land this in this very strong winds? <laughs> They say it's going to be raining on Friday. One 
full speed. I just hope not it will be raining men, only the water drops. This is the full speed we see it. Oh, look at this crazy rule, see? Now we cut the engine and let's see how it glides. Oh, not bad. Hey, look at this. See? What? Is it like a stone or a, a or as a more like a stone? Yes. I can almost stand still because of the wind. Do you see this? Hey? Yes. <laughs> It's going like a camel. Look at this, say. Do you see it? Good. Yes. I'm zooming. It's pretty. It's pretty hard to play, uh, film this plane. Well, it's smooth, hey, Captain. Yes. I haven't lost it even for a second. But at least I can fly slower, and this will be pretty good landing in this wind. Now, sometimes you were the wind is sexy. I mean, the wind is sexy. If you're screwing with the plane, not doing the maiden flight, eh? <laughs> but if you're screwing, you don't need any wind. The plane, I mean. Don't forget about the timer for the first time. I have the timer, don't worry. And I must tell to the viewers, say, look at this. This CG, eh? Yeah. This battery, eh? Graphene, this it, eh? graphene battery all the way to the front. I must fly a little faster because, hey. Time look at this. Now don't have to zoom too much, eh? Pretty fast and very agile, huh? Oh, it can turn pretty good, eh? If the plane was like this in the Second World War, hey, this will be the winner, eh? The Zeros wouldn't have a no chance. No wonder the Finlands won the war. Now they have actually made the wooden one, say, eh? because they like it so much, eh? Look yeah. at this, eh? Oh, <laughs> but hey, this is something viewers to buy. 30 seconds. Okay, prepare for the landing. I will just come by once more. No, don't risk it. Eh, but Captain Blush, eh? eh? Why are you always risking? I wasn't flying the full throttle at the time, so we can see it once more. I can handle this. I will come sexy and slowly once more. Nine, eight, In all its glory, do you see it now? Yes. And you had to go up when I was zooming. And you walk out. It's pretty strong. What can I do? Hey, don't fly just... in a straight line. And now for the landing? Yes, do it. For the best landing ever. With a sexy Brewster Buffalo. Buffalo, look at this. I will come sexy and slowly in the wind. Day. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Hey, salute. Hey, for this, hey, for this. In this kind of wind, look, look at the wind socket. Look at this. <laughs> look at this. But like I said, viewers, I it's, mean, a, it's at a 90 degree <laughs> angle, eh? It's not the perfect filming in the wind because you have the noise on the camera. But sometimes, hey, you can use that wind. I mean, it's fun to screw in the wind. But but not like I said on the maiden flight, because you've gone trim the plane good. But still, hey, hey, I will tell you that, hey, I'm really impressed. Hey, now film here, Captain Blush, don't zoom all the time somewhere. Hey. What's this? This is the point. Someone is burning firewood. Yeah. Hey, don't, because, hey. What? There is forbidden to burn the fire here now. Yeah, but who it's cares? Yeah, who, who knows cares? who that is? Yeah, well, hey. It's not you. You will get the cops there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. When this no, video, quick, the blush, give when this checker. video, when this video will be up, there will be no more fire. Well, hey, you should listen to the government. If they say that you can't burn the fire in the nature, you you must not. And in this strong wind, day. Hey. Because of the drought. But but screw that, day. Hey. Hey, film here. Hey, but you were starting to mention the government. Who cares about we the government? We are testing the planes here. Now show to the viewers what. I will grab it. You don't have to grab it. Show. Do you see it? Just tell me if you see it. It's now, you... cold as a stone. Yeah, yeah, nothing, gay. Okay. Chuck, wait. Yeah, Chuck, check. yeah, yes, yeah, Chuck, Chuck. Oh, the ESC is barely a little warm, eh? Do you see it? Yes, show hey, me. Perfect. Show now, me. of course, the graphene 2265C, and I will tell you, viewers, hey, viewers, this battery, this is bigger than the ordinary 22. Don't be screwed, eh? Because with this one, all the way that you can put it forward, a little velcro here, tape on, eh, and you will have 
the perfect G spot in the world. Now, of course, after look at this, four minutes and twenty minutes, uh, twenty yeah, seconds. Yeah, yeah, of course, yes, yes. <laughs> after four minutes and twenty seconds, we have left. Oh, oh, sick! What do you have set? Four minutes. Four minutes. You can set it at five, and and you can fly. I will call it like this. I will set it right now to five, and that is you can fly at the high mixed. speed. Yeah, you can have, you can fly mixed. Yeah. Five minutes on high speed, and I will just change it right now. Viewers, change that while you still know. Like we said, five minutes with the high speed flying with 2200 graphene 65C battery, which will give you the perfect G spot. And that's it. Eh? Now, of course, I will turn it to you, Captain Blush. Tell me, do you see it good? Eh? Yes. Uh, of course, viewers, I had to paint these tips to white because eh, I just love white tips on the plane, see? So this is it, a few words at the end. What to tell about this plane? I kept the much concentrate here, eh? Don't was, just fiddle with the phone all the time. I just had I to will, will return even... the message to John Townsend. <laughs> hey, John! He was asking, John Townsend he was asking me now, eh? which plane did, did you got from that box, the big box. Well, they already knew what plane. You will check on the Facebook, you will see that finally, a hey, finally, my dream EDF jet has arrived to my hangar and hey. <laughs> yeah, tell them which and one. I won't tell them. Yeah, you, just said they, you just said that they can they check on the... See. Yeah, yeah, but they don't all check on the Facebook. So viewers, go there and you will see what I have, eh? Hey. So this is it. I was telling about this sexy, beautiful Judafly Buffalo. Hey, from the moment, viewers, that I saw this plane, hey, I knew that it will be the great flyer. And, and I must send you to fly once more for this. They have made it possible so every single pilot in the world can enjoy flying this, this Buffalo iconic plane. And I will tell you that even in the strong wind like we have today, hey, this was a perfect test. Hey, I could, you could manage the plane without no problem, and the power is so sick. Hey. And now, we have gone after uh, uh, through that maiden hand tossing because the first time that you hand toss the plane is always the hardest because you don't know what will happen. But this one, just throw yes. it up eh, like this in this angle eh, and the plane will just go up. Yes, when you toss it, booty, eh. when you toss it for the first time, you never know what can come out. Eh? <laughs> we still all can remember our first hand tossing, say. Of yes, the plane, of course. That was scary. Thing. My first hand tosser was. Was Easy Star? No, Captain Blast. Eon, Eon 400 from Graupner, Yes, yes. I won't tell to the viewers what you were hand tossing for the first time, but let's stick with the plane. Say eh? here. Yes, yes. <laughs> so what to tell at the end, viewers? Can you hear the sirens? I can tell you. Don't distract me, viewers. I can tell you, viewers, that this is really, really beautiful plane. It flies great. <laughs> You don't have, you have seen the landing with this. I mean, if you put yourself the brake, hey, that's it, hey. Oh yeah, I can hit the sirens. They're going to that fire that you were filming, Captain Blush. Yeah, you, yeah. Won't break, <laughs> you won't break the prop. Hey, the fire stopped. There's no more smoke. <laughs> I think that somebody has called the cops, hey, because of that. Or maybe the fire department, hey. Because it's forbidden to, to make a fire here. Yeah, yes, it's because of the drought. Yeah, because it's a drought, viewers, and that's not something to screw about. But we were here with the plane, but once again, I can't stop this video, Captain Blaché. Beautiful, iconic plane that you can buy on Hobby King. Of course, you will have the link below. And I will tell you right now that if I just compare this to the Jurafly Bonanza plane, I mean, that plane is also beautiful and very sexy to fly. But this one is much, much easier and uh, much more fun. Really, and you can see it really good in this paint. A, eh, it is perfect for such hey. beautiful, hey. sexy, sunny days. Hey, eh. what do you say? This, eh. Hey, what do you say? What? Huh? Is this very easy to handle? Well, it is, but why? What again? I have an engine for it, eh? <laughs> Yo, cap the blush, eh? 1.5 cc. You would put no nitro engine on everything, eh? And this one could be with the nitro. I can already imagine this. I've one, got eh. that one with the rear exhaust. This one would be perfect to convert it to nitro. The AP was, But you won't convert this one, Captain Blush. Because in fact, I will tell you... Why? Viewers, oh, why? I will tell you, viewers, that I really like this plane. And for once, eh, because in the past, all the planes were flying... All the planes were flying on 2200 batteries, eh? 
and recently hey, everything is on four cell on six cell and you just can't use those batteries anymore and they're lying there and now you have the perfect plane to put those batteries back in USA and I can tell you right now at day you can just put this in the car and just have it with you and just when you get an opportunity just take it out and what the hell hey so this is it I'm really loving this hey, hey really, we have hey, to stop because we got another uh, another maiden hey because the, the wind is uh so this is it. the wind off. has almost stopped now it isn't but hey who cares about this hey viewers just click something, eh? And you have great opportunity to, to click this one. And this is even for the great price, eh? It's, it's really cheap, eh? And I will tell you that for this kind of money, you get a lot, a lot, viewers, eh? So this is it. And yes. hey, we must stop this video somehow, eh? Pilot Robert and Captain Blas signing off from Slovenia with another great successful maiden flight with another beautiful, <coughs> not edited amateur video of the beautiful sexy brand new the hottest stuff on the hobby king the jurafly brewster buffalo eh? Eh, the plane that you just must have eh? Eh, I, and i will hang this in my hangar below because i will watch this plane every day because it's even had the special meaning because i didn't know that this was actually the first american navy plane eh? and didn't you already I, I, stop I look at it now totally with different eyes didn't eh? you already stop the video <laughs> no captain Muska, quick because we have the second plane in the car waiting and that one hey, the whole world is waiting to see the world what will happen if Captain Mosh cut and stop already eh? <laughs>